What's up y'all? Sam Love in the Calumet Wilderness. Red and gray vest, you know what that means. Bill Murray hat, you know what that means. We're hitting the water today. Come on along. Hey, thanks to all the viewers, subscribers, folks leaving comments, likes. I really appreciate all that. It makes me feel like there's a lot more people out here that appreciate the Calumet Wilderness. Or wildness or nature, whatever you want to call it. Let's get to work. Now the plan for today, I'm going to be heading with the current, which is really awesome. Starting here at Bicentennial Park and Lake Station. And I'm going to make my way all around to uh, Liverpool Road. There's a little pull off there. It's convenient. So the first bit's uh, wooded. And then I'll be going through the uh, border of uh, Lake Station on the north and New Chicago to the south. So it should be fun. We'll see how long it takes. Get a little sense of the current here. And the traffic, always the traffic. Some people out enjoying the river as well. And they just told me that it's all smooth paddling ahead, which is great to know. I don't know anything about this covered bridge off the top of my head. I obviously have resources at home I could look up later, but uh, not worried about that right now. Yeah, so I don't know how old it is or it's like more of a recent project. Nature always takes over, doesn't it? Cool dune ridge, a little bit of fall color. Gorgeous. Yeah, it's nice to see banks that aren't thoroughly eroded, even if there are a few tires here and there. If you hear kids' voices, there's some kids on a property just behind me a little bit. It's so nice to look out and not see any artifice. Although there is a water tower hiding behind that tree line. Probably can't see it on the cruddy little YouTube video. I'm thinking the water may have been a bit higher. Seriously though, a lot of folks who live along Deep River have uh, voiced complaints and concerns about the low water level since the dam's been taken out. But if they're upset and you want to sell your property, why don't you just give me a call? Samuel A. Love.
Oh, if anybody's looking for a boat to join me on these adventures, we could pull this one out here. You're gonna clean it up though. Found a waterfall. That sound should let you know I'm under a bridge right now. Hello, Mr. Heron, or Ms. Heron. can't really see them but there are up there a bunch of geese and they were making a lot of noise as I was working my way over so that should be fun to proceed through pray for your boy right now okay we'll see how I turn out After, after surviving the phalanx of geese, I saw this. I said, please let there be one passing through that log dam. Pretty cool structure. Well, I guess it's some kind of art project. Well, last view before I reach my destination. I'm going to Liverpool Road. It's been a very uh, easy paddle. It's been a lot quicker than I thought, and I've been taking my time. Very open. I was wrong about going uh, with the current. There basically is no current until the wind blows, which is mostly coming out of the south and west. So I was sort of going against the current, I guess, in a way. But again, very easy, very open, yeah, very nice. We've got another boat here, probably super cheap. It's gonna need a little work. There's my lovely wife. I was gonna have her pick me up at Liverpool, but the, uh, the new uh, Rip Rap project is, uh, yeah, you don't have to keep waving. Sorry, I'm talking to the people now. <laughs> Nobody's out there fishing, so it's clear, fair, free and clear. I'm gonna go down. It's like our little region uh, version of Whitewater Rapids here. So see you, in a, see you in a second. Hey, before I go hurtling headfirst into the Whitewater Rapids of Deep River, I just wanted to thank everybody for joining the adventures. Please subscribe, please leave some comments. Love to get a dialogue going, and uh, all right, I'm gonna go have some fun now. See you in a bit. We'll see how well this works this time. I hope I don't ruin my phone doing this. I also hope I don't ruin my body doing this. It's not as shallow here as it just was, but it makes it a little tough. I'm not the first to do this on video and post it to YouTube. Someone else did. If I can find it, I'll post the link. And that fella tried going up this. I'm not doing that. 
Oops. Oh shit. Can you see this egret up ahead? This is a twist. There's two. It's just hanging out. All right, hey friends, you're coming with me. Any final words? My final word is, God, I hope I don't lose my phone. Oh shit. I don't even know if I was filming the whole time, but it was very cold. <laughs> to get my bilge balls out tonight. All right, one last one. Probably ruined my camera phone doing this. Whew. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's just a little cold when it hits you. Last one. Hoo, hoo, hoo. I don't know how much of that came out and my phone's still working, which is awesome, but that was cool. I'm going to have to do that with somebody filming me from up there. All right. Once again, thank you, everybody. We'll see what came out of that footage. I had a great time. We're going to do that again. You should come on with me for another adventure in the Calumet wilderness. Take care. Please hit subscribe. Please share this with your friends.